Hello world, this is Imani David coming at you. I've been asked over the last few months to show a little bit of my collection. I can do that, I'll show a little bit of it. Um, I've been, I'm advised by counsel not to show any of it, but you know what? If somebody wants to do something, they will, and counsel will make more money, whatever. Um, this is the Jajir Lecoultre, Ultra Master Thin Perpetual in Rose Gold. I hope you guys can see this. Um, it is reference number 1302520, powered by the Shajir Caliber 868. Uh, this is a 39mm watch, and as you can see, it's got the date, the year, the month, and the day of the week, as well as the moon phase. Uh, it is on the alligator strap in rose gold. I'm not going to review this because there's enough information on the web already about it, but this this watch it's not on the deployant buckle uh, I'm going to change that because I'm getting some fraying here as you can maybe see uh, don't like that this is the only watch I have and you would think at this price point they would come automatically with the deployant buckle but the dealer um, did not supply one with the watch and so there it is but I could always get one later if I wanted Ultra Master Thin Perpetual, it's 9.2 millimeters thick. Let's see if we can get a close-up of that movement. The rotor has the Shishio Lakolta on it. Um, you know, as far as the website goes, it has 336 pieces inside. It vibrates at 28,800 beats per minute, I'm sorry, per hour. And it's just a really classy piece. I like it very much. Um, got this in Rome from a dealer in Rome when I was vacationing there. And I think it's just an overall beautiful piece. If you're looking for a nice dress watch, guys, that is from a brand that is time-tested and is very elite. You can go with the Jagir. You can't go wrong with the Jagir. I know some people are going to say Jager. I don't care. Tomato, tomato. Um, just go get it, all right, if you like it. Uh, beautiful piece. I'm going to leave it at that. Um, I gave you some of the specs. And, you know, leave some comments, guys. Um, and some questions, okay? Uh, my collection tends to be of only high-end watches um, and they are part of um, something that I hope will be extremely important later on but this is all there is I know I find myself rambling all right talk to you guys later hope you enjoyed this mini kind of I don't know um, showing off the collection there's some other things in here this is my Gurkha Time Traveler uh, case. It's got uh, a few pieces in there. And, um, you know, I'll just leave it at that for now. Hope you guys enjoyed that little itty bitty bit. And let me know, guys. All right, if I should do more of that. And perhaps I will. Okay. Yeah, I need to get some equipment. All right, talk to you guys.